Good morning, everyone, and welcome to another AV Properties House Tour. Today, we will explore your future haven in these luxury townhouses in a prime location that is Tomas Morato. Now, before we start, please don't forget to click subscribe to AV Properties' official YouTube channel. You can also check us out on Facebook and on Instagram. It's at AV Properties underscore official for all of our fresh listings. It's me again, Apple Grace, and you know the drill. So I'll be inviting you guys to follow me to the ground floor level so I could show you the first part of our house tour. And here we are on the ground floor of this five-story townhouse. This is your garage or your covered carport. This can fit four cars comfortably. But if you want to opt for a two-level car lift like this one, then add three more cars in your list. And now let's check out what's inside. Let's go! Hey, so this door is equipped with a digital lock system. So it closes down, it makes a sound, it will require you a pin code and a swipe card. Now this door right here would be our staff room. So this is a nicely spaced room and our staff can actually enjoy their very own um, built-in cabinet right behind the door. And we have a double decker here and there's a window for ventilation. Let's close this and here we are. I'm standing right in front of the foyer or this is a spot for your foyer. So this is nicely designed. So this is the first thing that you will actually see upon entering the house. This house is equipped with an elevator that services the ground floor up to the fifth floor. And this one is imported from Sweden and it fits two persons. So let's check out the staff toilet and bath. There you have your water closet, your sink, everything that you need. You have your shower as well. Yeah, so that completes the tour of the ground level. Now let's check out what's on the second floor. Hi, so we are stepping on Tangili slabs for our staircase. And all of the wood floorings found in this house are all made of nada. Right behind me is, of course, our service elevator. We have the foyer. And now, let me go around your living area. Wow. Okay, let me just take a breather right here. So guys, enjoy this view. So it's an open layout for your living and your dining area. So you can see you have your classically designed cove ceiling and recessed lightings for that mood or that mood setter. This is your dining area. As you can see, this can fit um, eight, an eight-seater dining table for a growing family. And then right behind me, this is where the powder room is. Wow. So if you remember the facade um, of our lobby or the common area earlier, so that was the first part of our um, introduction. So they're using or they have a theme like it's a brutalist theme, very minimalist. And now after the living area, the dining, the powder room, guys, follow me as we check out our enclosed kitchen. Come on. So here we are in your kitchen. countertops here and we have a center island or an island counter and all of our countertops are made of granite and then you have your frosted glass cupboards so the color combinations is really nice it's not chaotic at all so this space really is calming and a place for you to really enjoy what you love the most like mel um prepping your meals for the family and then right behind me would be a spot for maybe an air well. Okay, so you have a lot of storage spaces. 
And these are soft close mechanisms. Our mechanism. So more drawers for your kitchen stuff. And this spot right here is for your double door fridge. And more overhead cabinets for storage. And on this spot, you know how the kids like it um, to stay in the kitchen and do their homework, right? So there's a lot of counter spaces for them. They could be prepping the meal over there and the kids would be doing their homework here, right? And yes, that is the second level of this five-story townhome. And now guys, let us check out and try the elevator. Okay, so all you have to do is just press this one, wait for it. Okay, so this is um, really exciting for me. Wala kaming ganito sa bahay. Ewan ko lang sa inyo guys, now let us know on the comment section below if you actually have an elevator at home. So this is a very thoughtful feature, especially if you're thinking ahead, right? You want to future-proof your home. So let us just make a twist and yeah, I'll be going to the third floor. And if you've decided which floor you're going, just press the buzzer, deal or no deal. Let's go. See you on the third floor. Bye. Here we are on the third floor. Okay, so guys, as mentioned earlier, the entire floor on this floor is actually occupied by the master bedroom. So let's go. Wow. Oh, oh. So again, this really is the master bedroom. It's very spacious and you get to enjoy your private balcony on this floor. You can see guys you have your again your cove ceiling with your mood lighting to set the mood after a long day of work and here we are so this door is going to lead to our walk-in closet and the master toilet and bath so let's go again the narrow uh, floor tiling runs from the master bedroom up until the walk-in closet so you have your built-in cabinets on both ends of the room and then you get to enjoy this really big vanity mirror right here and you have a lot of you know cabinets and drawers and you have to love the combination of um, the elements in the walk-in closet you have your wood and your metal elements so this is very classic so even if um, some trends comes up and you know pops up this one never goes out of style. So one step down, you'll find yourself in your master toilet and bath. You have your water closet on the right side. Right behind me would be your gigantic vanity mirror. And then you have your single sink. This is a floating vanity. And then here is where your shower area is. You have your shower niche and you have to love the accent of this geometric or this mosaic um, tiles here. Then here's your shower. This could actually be enclosed as well with a glass enclosure. And if you wanna keep the moist out of your walk-in closet, so you have your wood frames here. This is also, um, this can be enclosed. Yeah. So guys, let me know if you like the design of the master toilet and bath, the master bedroom, the balcony, and of course, my favorite, the elevator. Okay, so now we're gonna proceed to the upper level. Let's check out bedroom number two and number three. So I will just be climbing up the stairs now. See you guys. Here we are on the fourth floor. 
So we all know that townhouses are actually regarded as um, houses that is perfect for growing families or startup families. So this townhouse has four bedrooms all in all. On this floor, we have two bedrooms. So this is the first bedroom or bedroom number two. So look how beautiful it is. Since this is a model townhouse or a model unit, um, you can actually stage it the way you want. So this is just um, how the developer want to show what you can do with the house or how you can design it. And then here is your shower, your water closet, you have your vanity, and then all of the vanity mirrors in each toilet and bath are actually bigger than the usual vanity mirrors that you see. And then you have your built-in cabinets here. So a lot of storage spaces. Meron pang overhead storage. Now let's close this one. And yes, gotta love the color. So if you like the design of this model unit, you can opt for this one as well. Yon, close natin. And we're gonna check out bedroom number three, which I consider is the junior master suite because this one is actually much, much bigger than the other um, cuts of the other bedrooms. So here. Really nicely staged. Again, if you like the design, you can talk to us. <laughs> okay, so now guys, let's check out the walk-in closet. Here it is. So it's right beside a window. So it welcomes natural lighting. And here we are in your shower area. You have your water closet and this is a nicely designed sink. And again, <laughs> ang laki ng vanity mirror. Share it with your friends when you do your mirror selfies. I know everyone likes that. Or maybe it's just me and my friends. <laughs> okay. Hmm. So guys, if you're gonna choose which bedroom do you prefer? Bedroom number two or bedroom number three? <laughs> Let us know in the comment section below. So now, we're gonna be proceeding to the fifth floor where the sun deck is. Let's go. Woo! So, so here we are, guys. Welcome to the fifth level where you can find the sun deck or the roof deck and of course bedroom number four. So let's check out how this one is being transformed or utilized at the moment. So yes, this is used as a family area, entertainment, lounge area. But when you move in or you know get your townhouse here, you could actually transform this one as a guest room or an office. So there's a lot of storage spaces for you. You have your built-in cabinet on this side. So you have your shelves. And then another one on this side where you can hang your clothes. And then guys, okay, let's check out the toilet and bath because I super love the layout of this toilet and bath. I don't know, it just feels so much bigger than it actually is. Love the tiles that's being used over here it has that you know neutral earth palette that's very calming right let me know if you agree with me so you have all of your toilet essentials and again this one can be enclosed so there you've seen the toilet and bath now i will take you outside for a little sun break or sun date. Welcome to your roof deck. Oh, fresh air. <laughs> okay, so this space right here, I believe can hold 10 to 15 people comfortably with you know enough distance from each other. This is actually a perfect spot for you to do your morning yoga or a Zoom workout with your friends. And yes, this is a perfect spot to cook up those ideas of you what you wanna do for the entire week, right? So, yep, 
let's go back inside i hope you guys enjoyed it let us know on the comment section which part of the house is actually your favorite and if you're gonna choose your bedroom let me know if it's gonna be the junior master suite bedroom number three or bedroom number four on this floor okay so hmm am i gonna take the stairs down or the elevator Shampre, obvious choice the elevator so again going in gonna be pressing the buzzer give it a good twist second floor see you there Bye. guys so we've come to the end of our house tour for today let us know in our comment section below which part of the house is your favorite and if you want to learn more about this property all you have to do is check out our details section down below and before i let you go please don't forget to click subscribe to av properties official youtube channel and don't forget to ring that bell so you get reminded whenever we post our videos here on youtube you can also check us out on facebook and on instagram it's at AV Properties underscore official for all of our fresh listings. Now, if you want to list your properties with us, all you have to do is send us an email. It's at avproperties.official at gmail.com. This has been Apple Grace telling you guys thank you so much for staying with us up until the end of this video. And a quick reminder to please always be safe and wear your mask and always sanitize. See you in the next videos, guys.